Actions speak louder than words, and a smile says, I like you. You make me happy. I am glad to see you. You can make more friends in two months by becoming interested in other people than you can in two years by trying to get other people interested in you. Control your temper. Remember, you can measure the size of a person by what makes him or her angry. No matter what happens, always be yourself. You can conquer almost any fear if you will only make up your mind to do so. For remember, fear doesn't exist anywhere except in the mind. Don't be afraid of enemies who attack you. Be afraid of the friends who flatter you. When we hate our enemies, we are giving them power over us, power over our sleep, our appetites, our blood pressure, our health, and our happiness. Develop success from failures. Discouragement and failure are two of the surest stepping stones to success. Everybody in the world is seeking happiness, and there is one sure way to find it. That is by controlling your thoughts. Happiness doesn't depend on outward conditions. It depends on inner conditions. If you are not in the process of becoming the person you want to be, you are automatically engaged in becoming the person you don't want to be. Tell the audience what you're going to say, say it, then tell them what you said. Names are the sweetest and most important sound in any language. Talk to someone about themselves and they'll listen for hours. The world is full of people who are grabbing and self-seeking. So the rare individual who unselfishly tries to serve others has an enormous advantage. It isn't what you have or who you are or where you are or what you are doing that makes you happy or unhappy. It is what you think about it. One reason why birds and horses are not unhappy is because they are not trying to impress other birds and horses. The world is full of people who are grabbing and self-seeking. So the rare individual who unselfishly tries to serve others has an enormous advantage. Even God doesn't propose to judge a man till his last days. Why should you and I? If you can't sleep, then get up and do something instead of lying there and worrying. It's the worry that gets you, not the loss of sleep. You can't win an argument. You can't because if you lose it, you lose it, and if you win it, you lose it. Tell the audience what you're going to say, say it, then tell them what you said. There are always three speeches, for every one you actually gave. The one you practiced, the one you gave, and the one you wish you gave. If you tell me how you get your feeling of importance, I'll tell you what you are. The expression one wears on one's face is far more important than the clothes one wears on one's back. The best possible way to prepare for tomorrow is to concentrate with all your intelligence, all your enthusiasm, on doing today's work superbly today. That is the only possible way you can prepare for the future. Don't be afraid to give your best to what seemingly are small jobs. Every time you conquer one it makes you that much stronger. If you do the little jobs well, the big ones will tend to take care of themselves. Our fatigue is often caused not by work, but by worry, frustration and resentment. Let's not allow ourselves to be upset by small things we should despise and forget. Remember life is too short to be little. Flattery is telling the other person precisely what he thinks about himself. By fighting you never get enough but by yielding you get more than you expected. 
flaming enthusiasm, backed by horse sense and persistence, is the quality that most frequently makes for success. We all have possibilities we don't know about. We can do things we don't even dream we can do. People rarely succeed unless they have fun in what they are doing. Any fool can criticize, complain, and condemn, and most fools do. But it takes character and self-control to be understanding and forgiving. A barber lathers a man before he shaves him. Be wiser than other people if you can, but do not tell them so. Most of the important things in the world have been accomplished by people who have kept on trying when there seemed to be no hope at all. First ask yourself, what is the worst that can happen? Then prepare to accept it. Then proceed to improve on the worst. All men have fears, but the brave put down their fears and go forward, sometimes to death, but always to victory.